Next. Mediterranean diet, the best prevention against prostate cancer. In a study by the University of South Australia, um, they showed that men who stick to a predominantly Mediterranean diet are less likely to be diagnosed with prostate cancer. This diet also improves their chances of recovery if they have prostate cancer and are undergoing treatment. The researchers compared micronutrient plasma concentrations, blood plasma concentrations, of prostate cancer patients with a healthy control group, revealing low levels of lutein, lycopene, alpha carotene, and selenium in uh, prostate cancer patients, and high levels of iron, sulfur, and calcium in the same group relative to controls. So that would mean you want to increase foods that are rich in lutein, lutein, lycopene, uh, and selenium. So root foods that are rich in lycopene include tomatoes, melons, papayas, grapes with seeds, peaches, watermelons with seeds, and cranberries. Okay. Foods that are rich in selenium, dark green leafy vegetables. Additionally, the study found that diets high in dairy products and low in vitamin E may also increase the risk, but the evidence is not quite clear. And vitamin E is found in plant-based oils, nuts, seeds, fruits, and vegetables. In conclusion, uh, diet is tricky. So whenever we talk about your diet, it's important to do your own research and find out what is best for you. Because one person might be able to do keto. Other person may not do well with that. One person might be able to do the vegan diet. Other person may not do well with that. One person might be the heavy protein meat, red meat raw, the whole shebang, eggs in the morning, do wonderful. And then the other person that tries that and does that all day, you talking about colon issues, heart issues. So you have to do research on yourself and, and be more cognizant of how you feel when you eat certain foods. That's the, uh, the, the tricky part with diet. Another thing is a lot of our foods now, we have to be honest with ourselves. They don't have the same nutrients as our ancestors fruits and vegetables when they were picking it straight from the tree. Now we walk around the grocery stores with baskets uh, picking fruits off of shelves where back in our ancestors day they, they could go to a farmer's market or go down the street or pick it off the tree themselves. So we, you, you also might want to consider um, supplementing your diet with, with multivitamins, probiotics, etc. Thank you all for watching. If you like this content, please click the like button, subscribe. Thank you for joining. One love.